Today an addenda was received concerning the Green Hills ISD Classroom Edition. Some of the pre-finished doors were omitted in lieu of hollow metal doors and all of the pre-finished door frames have been replaced with hollow metal frames. The pre-finished doors on each classroom have a light with a hollow metal frame that measures 6 inches by 2 foot. The bid date has changed to May 7, 2009. We will look over the task we have in the Extimatics Estimating System to see how these tasks were set up. We will also add a task for the hollow metal light frames. Then we will add these doors and frames and lights to the project. These tasks each use a coat of primer. The items are sanded. Then two more coats of Alcat Sema Gloss are applied. We will use these same components in our hollow metal light task. This demonstration will show just how easy it is to make changes to a project when needed. Easy changes are just as important as easy entries of room finish schedule information or quantities. After looking over the task for painted doors and frames, we will build the task for painting hollow metal lights. All of these materials have been saved from the previous task, but we need to change the coverage rate and production rate. We will figure spraying these frames for all coats but the final coat before these frames are installed. The final coat will be applied with a brush after these frames have been installed. These tasks are fairly easy to set up, especially after the material is already saved into the Extimatics estimating system. Once we have this final task set up that we're going to need, we'll close this module. And let's open the projects module so we can set Extimatics to use our Green Hills ISD job. We'll add that we have received addendum number one in the inclusions, and let's change the bid date. After all the changes are made, we'll close this module. And now we're ready to enter our new doors, frames, and lights. In the space, we will enter the term doors and frames. The height is irrelevant, so in the height box, enter NA. the area box we use the term miscellaneous. This could have easily been various or any other designation that we wish. We're getting the doors and frames from the door schedule. Notice how we can enter the task for this space and now we will enter the quantities before closing the schedules module.
After entering the doors, frames, and lights, let's close this module and look at the reports. We see these doors have been added to the quantities report. Now we can open the extended quantities report and look at the breakdown of the labor and material for these doors, frames, and lights. We scroll to the bottom of the page to see the total price and see where we had deducted the three dollars before. Let's remove this so we can see the full price. Our new price is thirteen thousand and eighty three dollars. For this project let's change the bottom line to give us a competitive edge. This time we will deduct ninety five dollars from the total giving us a new price of twelve thousand nine hundred and eighty eight dollars. After printing these reports, let's close this module and we can click New Project to prepare estimatics to estimate another job. Happy estimating!